This video is about the library. What you would do is at the top of your page once you get into uh, Advanced 360 is the library tab is on your top right. Go ahead and click that. For now it will be uh, you'll have to log in with the exact same login you have for everything. So basically the same as in Power Web, the same as your email. Uh, basically put that information in there, uh, put your password and hit log in. Basically what you would want to do uh, to get information, basic research uh, information for each of your classes is to just type anything that you wanted in there. So let's say the Bible. Click go, of course. That'll come up to several different things. And then what you're going to want to do is filter by clicking this box to full text articles and that'll update. This is basically you getting articles as opposed to checking out a book uh, from the library. Scroll down through there and see, okay, that's a book, that's a book. Uh, what you're going to want to do, let's click, go ahead and click article. This way we can be able to access it um, from the internet as opposed to you checking it out. Click on that article there. Depending on what you would want to do, most likely you're going to want to view the full text. Uh, you have options as well to cite, to export, to print, to email as well. But you can view full text. It'll take a little while to come up there. You see that there. What you're going to want to do is click on PDF full text. It'll be easiest to read that way. You can read it right on the screen. You can print it. You can do a number of things. And of course, uh, you are also able to, to email it, you're able to print it uh, from these icons, you're able to export it, uh, able to make that a, grab that link to there to put it in a paper or whatever the case may be. And of course you can download it uh, to your desktop. And of course I would recommend that you upload it to your repository if you are collecting these articles for research. Um, but you can use this for any class. This is basically a basic uh, overview of what you need to do uh, when you're using the library. But of course, within the library itself, as you log in, there's a lot more detailed videos and tutorials on how to, to go into some intense research.